How's it going guys? Welcome back to my channel Fast Hands Gaming. I'm your boy Fast. So today we are back on Clash of Beasts. I know it's been a while. Um, I have been waiting for the content creator to be pushed out on the game so I can make videos. However, that seems to be lagging for whatever reason. So with so many people coming into the game now, I have decided just to keep making videos. So I'm going to do these next couple of videos will be pretty short. I'm going to do a tier list. Um, I don't know where everyone is in the game, so I am simply going to go over each tier and just go off of what is the best in each tier. So starting off with tier 1, we're going to go with the A+, which is going to be first, obviously, Alantara right here. Um, main reason is, and I'm going to try to be objective with all of these, she has an AoE. She has healing, she has a shield, and she has resist. So obviously she's the first epic you get into. Um, obviously is the biggest amount of power you're going to get in tier 1. Um, however, depending on how fast you are pushing, I would say, and I, again, she is, I would say she's A+, but I got her at level 5 and was able to push her and destroy bases for quite some time. She was a good carry. But if you push really fast, um, she falls off relatively quickly, especially if you get into Tier 2. Um, the next is going to be uh, Tyranta. I'd also say he, 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 she, I have to read the lore, um, is going to be another A+. Big thing is because he is a fast tap, also with the Predatory Cloak, um, one of the best skills in the game, hands down. Um, next, after that, I'd say a, going into A+, I would say uh, Brightwing. Again, mainly for the resist for the Sun Tower. Um, beginning of the game, having that resist Sun Towers is going to be a big thing. Lunaros, uh, the rare, um, is able to summon a, min a minion AoE. Not bad. It is a mage, so it's a little bit slower. And then I would also say Endoros. Um, as he can hit multiple towers with multiple projectiles at once, and being a tank helps him out a lot. Um, after that, I'd probably say Shadow Scale as a B, and Arcross as a B, same with uh, Talavera, and then obviously everything else kind of it goes down from there. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the video. I'll catch you next time for Tier 2. Peace.